Aquarius. This is a peek at your partner for the week of December the 23rd through December the 30th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Aquarius for December the 23rd through December the 30th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Aquarius for December the 23rd through December the 30th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Aquarius for December the 23rd through December the 30th, 2023. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. So, Aquarius. Aquarius, this is a peek at your partner. So, Aquarius, your partner has the Wheel of Fortune. Your partner has the devil. Your partner has the two of pentacles. Your partner has the four of cups. And your partner has the ace of swords. So, Aquarius, your partner has the wheel of fortune. This is divine timing at play. This is the karmic wheel of destiny. This is a faded event. This is change in your partner's luck and fortune. Where this wheel can spin and they can have good luck and fortune. Or this wheel can spin the other way and things can get a little rocky for your partner. So Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that everything between you guys has changed. Your partner could tell me it's an actual change in their luck and fortune. Or this is about divine timing. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is your partner saying with, without, or in spite of anyone. I alone in my own right am abundant, self-sufficient, independent, and single. I'm single. So Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that they're independently abundant on their own or they're single. Now, your partner could tell me that everything between you guys has changed. They are now single. I don't know what happened. We're going to find out. Your partner could tell me that they want to change things here. They no longer want to be single. Or your partner is telling me that, you know, there's been an actual change in their luck and fortune and they have this abundance. Aquarius, your partner has the devil. Could be dealing with a Capricorn. But this devil energy can speak of a toxic energy that is looming over you guys' relationship. And what makes it toxic is this restrictive and binding. Someone may be obsessive, possessive, controlling, abusive. Someone may have an addiction to sex, drugs, drinking, smoking, working too much, money, attention, gambling, sports, video games, eating too much. Anything that a person does too much of. Or someone here is in a full-blown relationship somewhere else causing this toxic energy to loom over you guys' relationship. So Aquarius could be dealing with a Capricorn, but when we're dealing with this devil energy, this can speak of something being toxic, restrictive, and binding. This can speak of a legal binding contract, but also temptation. Clarify the devil for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the devil for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the devil for Aquarius' partner. It is clarified with the magician. This is you, Aquarius, but your partner is trying to manifest, trying to make something happen. And they have all the tools and resources available to them to manifest whatsoever they will. They have the air element, the fire element, the water element, the earth element, and the ethers. So with great focus and intent, they can manifest. So Aquarius, this is you. Clarify the magician. 
for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the magician for Aquarius's partner. What does Aquarius's partner think of Aquarius? What does Aquarius's partner think of Aquarius? Clarify the magician for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with death. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. But death symbolizes to end something, only to begin something new. Death symbolizes transformation, rebirth. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, but your partner could tell me that something is ending here. Something could be starting new after an ending or some type of transformation or change. Clarify death for Aquarius' partner. Clarify death for Aquarius' partner. Clarify death for Aquarius' partner. It is clarified with a page of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is news or a message about a deep emotional connection. These are love messages or news of love. But this could also be the news about what love produced because there's a fish in this cup. So love messages and an apology. Now your partner could be receiving love messages and an apology. Your partner could be sending out love messages and an apology. Very well could be that we found love messages and heard the news of someone sharing love or some news about what love produced because pages are children and there's a fish in this cup. Clarify the page of cups for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the page of cups for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the page of cups for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the Ace of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is a brand new opportunity or something more solid, stable, and secure coming into your partner. Now, this can be an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, anything of value, brand new practical beginnings. So Aquarius, some type of opportunity of practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date or a commitment. Now, Aquarius, hmm. your partner could tell me that there's some type of good news coming into them concerning some type of legal binding contract or an agreement here with this practicality that actually changes their luck and fortune here, Aquarius. Aquarius, your partner could tell me that they're tempted to accept an apology or some type of gesture, token of love, uh, you know, some type of, uh, I don't know, dinner and a movie, something here, and start new after, in it? Because it very well could be coming from you or a commitment. But even though you're the magician, they could also be taking on this energy here of trying to manifest some type of change here. And it could be them wanting to come in with some type of an apology or offer of commitment because they no longer want to be single yet. Aquarius, your partner has a two of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is juggling. Now, this could be juggling two ideas. Should I, shouldn't I? Will I, won't I? This could be your partner managing many things at once, weighing up the pros and the cons, or juggling two relationships. So Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that they're weighing things up, trying to decide should they, shouldn't they? Or they're telling me that juggling has taken place here. Clarify the two of pentacles for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the two of pentacles for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the two of pentacles for Aquarius' partner. It is clarified with the eight of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This can indicate that things are happening quickly. This can speak to travel. But this is the fast, rapid moving energy of communicating back and forth over the airwaves, the internet, with text messages, messenger, WhatsApp, emails, phone calls, even face to face communication. But this is also the fast, rapid moving energy of being intimate. 
So, Aquarius, listen, your partner can tell me that something is happening quickly here. This could involve travel. You guys could have gotten into a heated discussion or argument, throwing fiery dots at one another. Or someone was communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else. You know, Aquarius, your partner could tell me that, yes, someone was communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else. They were juggling here, but mm, it just makes me feel like your partner is debating something here. Something is happening quickly here or some type of communication is coming in and they're debating having to make some type of decision here. Aquarius, your partner has the four of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. There is an offer on the table that your partner is not accepting nor rejecting. They're contemplating this offer, but actually they're bored with the offer, thinking of missing the offer. But this is also a card of your partner contemplating sending a offer, but they feared that the offer would be rejected. So Aquarius, very well could be an offer coming into your partner that they're thinking about missing. However, they could be contemplating sending a offer. They just have this fear it won't be accepted. Clarify the Four of Cups for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the Four of Cups for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the Four of Cups for Aquarius' partner. It is clarified with the Five of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is conflict. This is fussing, fighting, disagreements, arguments, jealousy, competition, drama. But this can also speak to your partner being conflicted within about something. So Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that they're conflicted within about something or some type of conflict, disagreement, argument, drama has taken place here. I mean, you guys could have had some type of heated discussion or argument. Yeah, but no, I feel like your partner's conflicted within about this offer to come in with this offer or to accept this offer debating here i mean you guys could have had some type of heated discussion or argument over the debate over rather not to accept a offer but i feel like they're conflicted within about this Your partner has Ace of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is truth. This is clarity. This is communication. Now, this could be the sword of decision, the sword of victory. But this could also be the sword that one reels to sever a relationship. So, Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that you guys are having this communication. Your partner could tell me that they've come into some truth and clarity. Your partner could tell me that they're making a decision or they're using this sword to sever Clarify the Ace of Swords for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. This queen is a very fiery, feisty, bold, and confident energy. Someone who handles their business with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this Queen of Wands. Now, the Queen of Wands is someone who's highly motivated, a self-starter, someone who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign, or your partner is wanting to take action here. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Aquarius' partner. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Aquarius' partner. It is clarified with the Ace of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is a brand new beginning in love. A brand new beginning in a deep emotional connection. This is love overflowing. A brand new blessing. A brand new beginning in love. So new love, new start to love, or a blessing. Three aces on the board and major change in this person's life. Things will never be the same. And I feel like they're having to make a decision here concerning this blessing, money, assets, resources, property. Or about starting new, this new love here. I'm going to take a look at the Hidden Truth Oracle for your partner.
can also say that they're making a decision and taking some type of action because someone here has new love. Did they feel like you were juggling? And they're just not in the mood for this apology. And yes, they're single now. And it says, I left when I saw you with someone. <laughs> I left when I saw you with someone. What else for Aquarius's partner? What else for Aquarius's partner? And it says, it's time for me to heal now. It's time for me to heal now. I left when I saw you with someone. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Aquarius, this is a peek at your partner for the week of December the 23rd through December the 30th, 2023. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at herimmortalmaj, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.